Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is CJ. Welcome back to episode 2 of my channel appetizer series. Now the channel we're featuring this time goes by the name of Jay's Reef. What you're looking at is a 57 gallon SPS dominated mixed reef. And the awesome part about this tank that makes it unique is that he started it off with natural seawater. Meaning this tank was started off with live rock, live sand, natural seawater, and that's pretty much the way he maintains it you know weekly water changes with natural seawater and just keeping everything as natural as possible tons and tons of great results as you guys can see but let's take a second and check out the equipment that's actually running this tank and keeping it looking nice so when it comes to the flow in this reef tank he's relying on dual aqua illumination Nero 5 pumps they're mounting on the back wall tons of flow you know random flow as you guys can see and definitely getting the job done for his system as far as lighting He's running three Aqua Illumination Prime HD. So, you know, three smaller lights, but used in conjunction, definitely tons of spread and tons of coverage lighting this full system for him. So let's take a peek underneath the hood because I think there's a lot more equipment down here to share with you guys. Now, as far as supplementing his tank, he's relying on a Neptune dose. I believe he's running two part bionic on a constant continuous cycle with that and also using a hydro fill auto top off. And then of course, a Phoenix heater as far as heating his system. Now all of this is controlled by an Apex Junior. Now for those that are not familiar with this, this is gonna be kind of the little brother to the Apex 2016. You know, it basically does the same thing. It just doesn't have the amount of outputs and outlets and some of the features. But as you guys can tell, you know, you don't need everything to run a reef tank. Now besides that equipment, this system also relies on a nice refugium he has set up you know, growing mangroves and calerpa and other macroalgaes, definitely helping, you know, keeping his nutrients in check. But other than that, that's it, guys. Just look at it. No skimmer, natural seawater, tons of growth, tons of success, a very heavy bio load, a ton of fish, and a whole different way than most people run their reef tanks. That's the point of this appetizer series, give you guys a taste, and hopefully, if you want more information, you'll slide over and smash that like button, subscribe button, and let them know that CJ sent you. But at this point, I want to make sure I cover for anyone that's new. If you want your channel featured in this or you want the chance to have me discuss your tank, look in the description below and I have full entry information as far as how you can get selected and what qualifies to get you on this series. So at this point, Hey, it's time to get out of here. I can't keep giving it away to you guys. So as always, hey, you like, comment, subscribe. You guys keep doing what y'all do. Y'all be easy and happy reefing. Peace.